The idea of a collaborative genius is one where a product of genius is conceived through the efforts of a group of individuals. Partnerships resulting in collaborative genius that might come readily to mind are music legends like the Beatles and Rodgers and Hammerstein, pioneers of quirky ice cream flavors Ben and Jerry's, and the Wright brothers who jointly invented the world's first airplane. And there exists instances when the environment can become the breeding ground for a collaborative genius. Just like in the case of Singapore, where the flourishing robotics industry has bred collaborative works of innovation amongst the young. Singapore is recognized as the hub of science and technology in Southeast Asia, and its vision is to become a leader in service robotic solutions. To create a sustainable pool of talent for the industry, Robotics was introduced in schools as a way of inspiring the country's young to deepen their knowledge of science and technology. Rulong Primary School uses robotics as a platform to inculcate creativity and innovation within its students. The school's robotics team has won many national and international awards. Perhaps that's because here at Rulong, students begin learning robotics at the age of seven. Robotics forms a key part of the curriculum. That's because mathematical and scientific theories and concepts are taught to the students through the use of robotics. The aim is to sow the seeds of innovation from a young age. And eventually, the best are brought together to produce collaborative works of genius in robotics. Meng Han's story is one that illustrates the effect of this collaborative effort. 11-year-old Meng Han is the leader of the Rulong Primary Robotics Team. He and his team are currently designing a robot for an international competition in the United States. But with the reputation of being one of the best junior robotic teams in the country, it comes as no surprise that expectations are sky high. The burden of these expectations is placed on all the members of the team, because in the case of robotics, the success of the end product always relies on team effort. When one person don't do their jobs properly, uh, the team will not be as good as the others because uh, once the research are not complete, we'll lack in the research part. And if the mechanical portion is not good, the robot might not run properly. The team will probably collapse if one person is not good in the team. Robotics requires a collaborative effort among a group of individuals. And at Rulang, teams are strategically created. Members are hand-picked based on merit and grouped together according to individual strengths. So at the end of the day, it's not just one person's hard work or genius, but rather the talent of each individual that makes the school's robotics team such a success. The achievements of Rulang Primary's robotics team are not merely the result of conducive structures in place to nurture innovation, for that would downplay the role played by collaboration in this case. Because while a good team can go on to produce good works, a great team can create works of genius.